Hello everyone, today I'm going to be trying out some Windwalker Monk and this is the build I'm going to be trying, doing some solo shuffle. Uh, Windwalker is like the second class I'm most interested in besides Demon Hunter right now and Dragonflight, so I'm going to give it a shot and see how I go. I, 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 I'm going to get focused. I, I usually pick the classes that always get focused. Usually, Demon Hunter was pretty focused and I imagine Windwalker is the same thing. Marksman Hunter and yep, see. Off to a, a great start already. Alright, shelled. I still have Serenity, which is good. Paralysis that guy. Alright, here we go. Let's hope this works. Fist of Fury! Did I get him? I got the Hunter. I got the Hunter. Yes, Serenity, man. Serenity is literally my favorite thing to play on um, as a monk. I never use it on live because it's just not really as, like, you know, as good as compared to um, Storm, Earth, and Fire. But I feel like with uh, Spiritual Focus, which reduces the cooldown Serenity over time, and uh, the duration of Serenity um, is increased... I feel like between those two, it's actually uh, gonna be pretty good. I don't know. I feel like Storm Earth and Fire is always gonna be um, like probably everybody's gonna be always playing it. But um, yeah, so I don't know. We'll see. At least I don't have to get focused by the hunter this time. Oh, I already got the Druid as stealth. Good job, hunter. Big damage for Thunder uh, Thunderfist, Fist of Fury. There's Dive of the Sword. Uh, Ring of Peace to save our Hunter, because he's stunned right now. Drip Soothing Mist. Uh, that's my bad, I shouldn't have done that. I got too close and then he stunned me there. Alright, we're going to uh, disarm the Warrior. It's Fury. Uh, I think that's every defensive now at this point. Okay, well, from the warrior, I should say, anyways. Stunned them all, because for whatever reason they stacked, and now... Oh, I didn't get that touch of death off. Oh, wait, Hunter killed him. Doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, man, I love Windwalker. Windwalker and Demon Hunter are just so fun. They're, like, almost all I play on live, too. 1.5 million damage. Yeah, the warrior is the weakest link, unfortunately. Is he on my team or I got the fire? I got the fire on my team. So, uh, either one we can kill here. Or try. So, do we go for the hunter or do we go for the warrior? Well, let's just start off with the hunter. The hunter is definitely the most threat. I don't think we want to let the hunter free cast, so. Did I get him as no, I didn't get him as stealth. Oh well, I had to try, right? Disarm. Uh, stun them both here. All right, it's fine. And just killed the warrior. <laughs> Oh man, the Serenity build is so fun. Yeah, just a quick uh, say that. Also, obviously, I, I, I have to say this literally like every single time I do a um, video on beta, but nothing is obviously tuned right now. Uh, people are still getting hit by like, for example, Enhancement Shamans can still hit like for like 200, 300k alley boss, so. That's just one example. Monk has been one of the few classes that have been uh, tuned so far, though. I just expect more tuning, probably. Okay, um... Go for the warrior again. Okay. Let's go on Karma here. He, yeah, he just... He, warrior just flops, dude. We got the warrior on my team. We have to go hunter. Feral won't. Uh, Feral's ne definitely never been a really good kill target, in my opinion. I feel like the Mist Reaver is really good too. So killing um, anything that has the Mist Reaver right now is going to be really strong. I feel like Mist Reavers are really, really powerful. 
I never thought I'd see that versus a priest, but I've seen a lot. This is like my fourth mystery we're seeing today, and every single time the mystery we're has done better than any healer. So, I don't know. We'll see. We're going to go for the hunter, though. Uh, I don't know why he's flaring. There's nobody that can stealth on our team. Obviously, I know, like I said, they're going to go for the warrior first. Alright. Yeah, they just immediately... I, I used every season. I even disarmed the uh, the hunter. And he trinkets. I stunned, and he still uh, the warrior still died. So the warrior is pretty much definitely the weakest link. That's why I never really can get into soul, uh, uh, to soul shovel that much. It's because, like... You pick on the on like the weakest link, and it just it, that's pretty much soul shuffle in a nutshell. Like for th for them, it's me and the feral. They're gonna go me because I'm the kill target. And then for us, we you know, to be honest, either the hunter or the warrior, are easy kills anyways. But um, obviously the warrior is just the lower threat, so we go for the warrior. Uh, I probably shouldn't have triggered that, actually. Oh, they're actually going for the Pharaoh. Interesting. Why did I disarm the warrior? Disarming the warrior is stupid. I should have disarmed the hunter. Rooted. It's fine. I still have my defenses, too. I haven't even... I'm, I'm gonna Karma now, actually. Uh, my touch of death not go off. on him touch of death and down they go and won five rounds uh 3.5 million damage hunter was second not really too surprised the hunter was actually kind of decent uh the feral uh 2.2 million and uh of course the poor warrior who got picked on the entire match 1.3 million damage and um yeah so move on to the next one all right, looks like we're facing an invoker. All right, evoker. I can never pronounce things right. I know I got that wrong apparently last time. So, Let's see if we can do anything here. All right. Uh. Oh, he's immune. Oh, I forgot that they have immune to CC. Duh. I don't have purge. Either way, there's still basically a free kill. <laughs> yeah, it, it doesn't light up, so. Uh, what's their PvP talent? Nullifying Shroud. Why does everything one shot? It's just because that's the way how beta is, man. I don't have any cooldowns, but sure, why not? Go ahead and try and reset. Alright, that's fine, because like I said, I want my cooldowns back up anyways. I completely dodged that roar, which is good. I had to go all out there. I, I had no cooldowns at the start, and I literally had to go all out there. Sure. Looks like he wants to go for another round. He's going to beat me this time. I have literally nothing up again. I imagine he doesn't have trinket either, though, so... All 
Alright guys, that's going to be it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this Windworker testing. Spoiler alert from the last clip when we get to the arena. Uh, didn't win. The Enhancement Shaman pretty much one shot both me and my partner. And um, yeah, I'm really just sick and tired of being hit by like 600k freaking lightning bolts or elemental blasts. Stuff like that. So that's it. See you guys later.